Hey guys, today we're going to talk about Brushland and there's many different versions of Brushland. All of them have increased rapidly in price due to the Adrazi. Just two years ago, in 2014, this card was only $1.41. It was at all-time low. The other editions, 10th edition, 7th edition, 9th edition, 5th edition, they were all under $2. Now, 5th edition being the more pricey one is $27.50. So when you take a look at the price, this is probably one of the better speculations for two years. It's gone over 10 times in value. I know the 5th edition one has probably gone even more, probably like 20 times in value. However, it is one of the more interesting things to talk about because this video is about something that's already spiked. Now, rotation is happening. We have enemy fetch lands. Uh, ah, enemy pain lands which are similar and they apply to similar decks so pick them up because at a dollar or after rotation is all said and done after Kaladesh comes and goes the will probably sit at a dollar maybe a dollar 25 and there will be a ton of supply and people view that as bad I don't view excess supply and something I want to buy as bad I view that as A, lowering the price so I can buy more, and B, being able to trade for them. So that is my perspective as to the enemy origin pain lands. The enemy pain lands were reprinted far less than the ally lands, and the ally lands seem to be doing perfectly fine. Yes, they were not reprinted in a mass set like Origins, or a recent set like Origins, but at you know dollar, dollar twenty-five, where I see them being very soon. Or if they're not already there, I like it. You know, I, I've always said the color patterns, it doesn't really matter to me. I'm just going to pick up as many of them as I can. Yeah, that's the same strategy I use for Force of Will. And that's how I accumulate so many of those because I was picking just all of them. And I actually thought Force of Will was the crappiest of them. I thought Contagion and Bounty of the Hunt would be the go to cards. Which was wrong, absolutely wrong, but I ended up with a ton of Force of Wills as well. So that's how I feel about Painlands. But probably the best two year solid speculation if you did make it. Uh, and if you saw the Adrazi and you immediately realized what it meant for these Painlands, you would have been very well off right now. Anyway, bye guys.